Hey, uh, let me remind you that tonight is uh, American Idol Night. Time to vote for Sanjaya. Yes. Again. Now I have to make good on my prime promise and vote. Yeah, I'm voting. I'll be up voting. It's hard for me. I've got this cold, so I go to bed early. I uh -huh. didn't even watch Dancing with the Stars. Who got the boot? I didn't even. Oh, wait a minute. Were they gonna? No. This week was another dancing show. Don't they have a results show? Oh, that's right. Tomorrow. Yeah. And American Idol's going to keep their show running later to screw up um, Dancing with the Stars. Right. They're going to so have mean. a delayed time show. People yeah. like those shows. What, what are you doing? Wait. They have to kill something that people yeah. like. Yeah. They have to ruin it for everyone. Because we can only have American Idol. Anyway, remember to vote for Sanjaya tonight. It's really great. Hi. This, this is Ozzy Osbourne. Vote Sanjaya. All right. <laughs> Ozzy's behind it. David Letterman's behind it. Hi, this is Dave Letterman. Won't you please vote for Sam Jaya? Sam Thank you very Jaya. much. <laughs> Someone suggested we call him Stern Jaya. Uh, David Lee Roth weighing in as well. Hey, this is Diamond David Lee Roth. Vote for Sam Jaya on Idol, baby. We're voting for Sam Jaya. <laughs> That's great. Hey, John Hine is here from the wrap-up show. What is it, Johnny? Uh, American Idol's on from 8 to 9 tonight. Yes. And then the Dancing with the Stars result show is on at 9. Yes, after. but American Idol has announced they are going to go a little bit past 9. Right, just to... But Dancing with the Stars is now... They're doing a recap show from 8 to 9, and the resu result show will be after... That is correct. Oh, so they're running from America. Right. They're, they're, uh, they even from. said they will uh, have results at the top of the hour so that people should tune in. This is very exciting. Oh, big, big night. Big night on TV. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't watch the answer with the stars last night. I was just, I just, I was so tired, man. I cannot, you know, I'm, I'm a first run 24 person, so I always have to see Dancing with the Stars on, uh, re, rerun. Well, Michael Jackson suggests everyone vote for Sanjaya. <laughs> Hi, this is Michael Jackson. Woohoo! If you vote for Sanjaya, I promise not to sleep with little boys. And you know how hard that can be. So vote Sanjaya. Thank you. I think that was high pitch, Eric. No, that was Michael Jackson. I know the difference. <laughs> I know who this is. Who's high pitch? Eric, uh, the midget. Hey, Eric, it's your worst night tonight. If we get Sanjay in uh, another week, it's going to freak you out. It won't happen. Oh, uh, what if it does? You said that last week. Yeah, guess what? What? He does make it past this week. I know he won't make it past next. Uh, we're going to keep him in as long as we can. You're Robin, just jealous. Robin, let me speak, please. As I was saying, you guys are off next week. You guys can't promote him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Spoiled again. How do you know our fans won't just do it on their own? <laughs> I'm hoping they don't. Right. You know, we got to get uh, Bubba on this for next ah, week. Ah, there you go. Who gave Eric our vacation schedule? <laughs> I didn't know we were off next week until just now. Yeah, I didn't either. Really? He, he threw in a monkey wrench. How do you know our vacation schedule? I re I've heard somewhere that you guys, you know, people are thinking that you guys are going on vacation sometime soon, and I was looking at my calendar, and I figured out by looking at the calendar that it's next week. Really? Eric's, Eric's infiltrated our system. <laughs> the, re the reason why I know is because the fact that Jason told me that, that the wrestling trivia contest is on the 9th, so I figure it's not that week. Uh. <laughs> so Jason's my weak link. Mm. Hey, Jason, get any more of that hot water? He has an inside spy. I have to cut off all communications between Eric the Midget and Jason. Yeah, he's uh, able old. to figure out what right. we're up to here. Well, Eric, uh, I believe we're going to be successful this week. I believe the fans and uh, all the people from that website, you know VoteForTheWorst.com, we are going to get together and vote for Sanjaya. What we could do is leave recorded messages. For next week, all of us urging people during whatever we're playing. Yes. On all channels. Yes. Yes. We're going to do an all-out effort. Absolutely. To thwart Eric the Midget. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for telling us that we were going on vacation so we can now plan. That's right. We're going to plan. <laughs> no.
I don't, I don't know if Gary told you or not, but I left him a message about a guy that works for a company that is tied to American Idol to say that he, he could get me to be able to go to any of the American Idol tapings between now and the end of the show. Wow. And the reason why he, the guy wanted me to bring it up to you guys is because he wanted to know if you wanted Howard 100 News or Howard On Demand to cover it. I'm watching Artie's pained face. I know. Talk. <laughs> like Artie's like, what is he talking Yeah, he's about? like, where is he going with this? Yeah, I mean, you got to snap it up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, make a point. Sometimes. Eric, we're on the air. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, you know, come on, dude. <laughs> People who rely on the show for laughs. trying to listen. It's like, you know. Because yeah, like I'm watching Artie's face, and yeah. Artie's like just disgusted. I and was I, looking at it, too. And then, you know, all you hear is. <laughs> A priest would have thrown you out of confession by then. <laughs> so it's now Wednesday, so you can show it. Cupcake in your fat mouth. <laughs> See, now you're on the ball. There you go. There you go. He spits out those insults rather well. Believe me, I'm pissed it's not Wednesday. So. <laughs> you missed the cupcakes, huh? I'm uh, actually uh, suggesting a uh, Cupcake Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> what are we going to do if there's like cupcakes every single day here? Then you're going to be ruined. I mean, if I those know. guys deliver every day, you would eat. I mean, it would be ridiculous. It doesn't matter because now Kim, the electrician, is uh, stepping up. With She's cooking. cooking for you? She does a great job. I've Who's never... Kim, the electrician? Kim, uh, she's this uh, cute girl here who uh, works as electrician, I was told. I don't, you know, I guess that's her title or whatever. And, I think I saw her in the hall yesterday. Tall girl? No, no, no. She's uh, like a light-skinned black chick. Uh, very cute. Not tall. But uh, she, uh, yeah, she makes cupcakes, the most moist cake part I've ever tasted. So she's flirting with you, is you saying? Or no, you I just know? think uh, she gave me a card, too. I think right. she's trying to start a cupcake business. <laughs> she knows Artie's a good customer. So how many cupcakes she is she making? Backing. I think she wants me to be the face of Kim's Cupcakes. <laughs> is she making cupcakes every day for you? No, no, oh. no. <laughs> but between I think crumbs, everyone's feeding Artie. Between crumbs on Just Wednesday, what he needs. Yeah. Yeah, we need more people around here who will feed Artie. It's like, you know what, when you have a dog that's overweight, you tell people, please don't feed the dog table scraps. Well, you know what it is? It's like in the zoo where they yeah. say, please don't feed the animals. We have to start putting up signs. People stop feeding Artie. <laughs> Why would you do that? Because you got, you, it's ridiculous. You're big as a house. No, I mean, but I like her cupcakes. You do? All right. Yeah. You're going to keep eating. And I'm trying to help her business. <laughs> <laughs> business. What, are you attracted to her? No, I, I, I'm attracted to her cupcakes. Yeah. <laughs> just trying to figure out what's going on over there. I don't think she's attracted to me. Uh, no, I just like her cupcakes. Right. She's a very nice person. I don't know. Well, all right. That's good. All right, Eric, look. I don't know what you just asked us. I think you said something about you have access to tapings at Idol. So, something yeah. about, yeah, you can get into any taping. So, And you can interview some of the American Idols? Yeah, a guy named Jason Adams. and Jason F. You're listening. You're calling to the show. All right. So, so if you want to go do some interviews, and we'll air them. Is right. That, is, it, is that what you're she, saying? Yes. Yeah, Shuey said he, he wanted to go with me to cover it. If you have the Howard 100 News, go with me. All right. We'll do that. Anytime you're doing so when, anything. So when are you going? Have you decided? I have not actually talked to him about what one of the tapings I'd go to. I want tape of Eric interviewing the American Idols. I mean, Please. why not? I don't think he's going to interview anybody. Oh, it's never going to happen. <laughs> Somebody's yanking his chain. You don't know that yet, Eric, but someone must be yanking your chain. You'll never. Uh, the odds of you getting backstage at American Idol and interviewing all the idols is slim, but hey, if you do it, fine. We'll take the tape. Howard, you're talking over me. <laughs> Yesterday you mentioned that you wanted to see... You know, me watching Idol on Howard On Demand or something? Yeah. This would kind of cover that, what you were talking about yesterday. No, but we want to see you in your little house wherever you are. You're not going to attack Sanjaya if you get backstage, are you? Are you going to interview Sanjaya or are you going to ignore him? Probably ignore him. Oh. That's not nice. That's not professional. He's, He's an idol. He's an idol whether you like it or not. And you'd have to interview him in a professional manner. I'd probably interview the sister instead. 
Yeah. He's an idol, and you're an incredibly creepy fan. <laughs> so, by definition, you have to pay attention That's to That's right. Him. You, you uh, shut up. should be talking to him. <laughs> That's right. You're like a mini stalker. Yeah. You're, you're not mini anything, are you? Gee, <laughs> 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 <Dude. laughs> that boy. That's a good one. That is a good that one. That is a good one. You're not, you're not a mini anything. <laughs> so, <laughs> there's many, and then there's what you are, sweetheart. Hey, he got one over on you. Yeah, you can you can take it, Artie. Now you're looking. Pathetic, no, I can't Artie. take it. I'm pissed off. <laughs> <laughs> no, Artie's looking a little desperate. All right, Eric, uh, touche, and let us know when we can have our interview tapes, okay? All right. Thank you, Eric. I'm back. Call me tomorrow after Sanjaya. Uh, call me. Let's see, Thursday yeah. after Sanjaya wins. Oh, I'll probably call tomorrow too. All right. Thank you. I'm back. For now. I think he'll want to try to discourage people. Hey, Eric, why'd you stop saying bye for now? I don't know. I just don't want to say that anymore. I mean, that was your whole thing. I right? love that. Yeah, wow. I love it. Bye for now. I use it since you, you won't. It starts to get worn out. All right, Eric, thank you. I felt bye. like Led bye. Zeppelin playing Stairway to Heaven <laughs> for the 900th time. I thought it was brilliant when Eric came up with bye for bye now. Bye for now. Bye for now. TTMF. Ta ta, motherfucker. <laughs> That's his new slogan. <laughs> that would be a good one, too.